How you doing? This is Don. Let me tell you, I'm about to answer the most asked question in all of Guns of Glory. How to get my money back. And you can go back 90 days on Google. If you're on Apple, you're screwed. If you paid via your phone, you're screwed. I'm not sure about Amazon. I will find out and do a separate video if there is a possible way. I know I, I use Amazon myself. At least two three thousand dollars use but as you can see in my account here thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars because we have to do what we're telling you about so we're just going to demonstrate the refund policy now because guns of glory does not respond in game they ask you for screenshots of something that doesn't exist and they deem dared to actually go to my own videos and declare that a Discord page was telling everybody how their game worked after they turned around and charged money. Guys, that's fraud. And it's fraud even in the eyes of Google. So, you go into your Google Play account. You gotta do it on a browser. You can't do it on your phone or device. So you're gonna have to go to a computer Got to go to the library if you don't own one. <clears throat> and then you're going to go to play.google.com. Uh, you're going to click on your account. You're going to go to your order history. And then you can go in here and just report a problem. Purchase is defective. Does not work as advertised. I got all the reasons. I know it doesn't work for the way I paid for it. Boom. That's it. What are the consequences of doing this? Well, you're going to get more money back than if you sold your account. And more importantly, you can do it after you sold your account if you're trying to screw somebody else over. But uh, you want somebody to pay for making half-assed decisions. Guys, I'll tell you what pissed me off to make this video was A, they pulled this crap during WWE last year. They sent lawyers after me. They lost. They've been bitter and pissed off ever since. The last two days, they sent a marketing company after me trying to derank my YouTube stuff. It backfired. I have gone up 400% in the last week alone. Uh, on a topic that I you know, don't care to be enthusiastic about anymore. I see no benefit to somebody doing business with this company. Uh, it's not that the game isn't fun. It's not that the game can't be fun. It's they don't have an interest in the game being fun. All the events are how much money can you spend in 72 hours. If you spend the most, you win. It's got nothing to do with skill or strategy anymore. Plus, they violate a few international laws with some of their gambling stuff where you click a button and you have no clue or guarantee what you're going to get. There are many countries now where that's a violation of law. You cannot sell gambling even if you're not giving out real cash rewards. You just can't do it. Uh, this is it, guys. Play.google.com. Go in there. Hit order history, report a problem, don't lie. Tell them the reason you're having a problem. The game is not what you paid for. If you bought guard cards last week and then today they're not worth what you paid for them, they knew they were selling them last week. A Discord channel or a line room somewhere is not the Fun Plus website. It is not even the in-game support system. You cannot change what you bought after the fact and not to expect there to be consequences to that. End of story. So I'm not telling you what to think or what to do. Don't lie or cheat Google. You'll only pay for it in the future. But you refund all this money. I guarantee you Fun Plus and decide to come back later in that same account. Fun Plus is going to demand you give every dollar back and get nothing for it. Even though that's a violation of Google policy. So, right now to the marketing company that's that's after me, I double dog dare you. Let's go really round and round on this stuff. 
I'm ready for your next response to this. Thank you, guys.